Hey Divi Nation and welcome to the next installment of our ongoing Divi Design Initiative where each week we've been giving away two free Divi layout packs. And for the first layout pack this week we have for you a beautiful, vibrant hosting company layout pack. With this new hosting company layout pack, you can promote your web hosting services online with confidence and style. The custom graphics and icons are beautifully crafted to illustrate a wide range of hosting features. It even has sections to help sell domains and feature hosting pricing plans. And with all the pages included, you can easily have a hosting website up and running with everything you need and more. Now go ahead and join me in this next part of the video where I can show you how you can use this layout pack on your own website. Now, before you can access this new pre-made layout pack from the Divi Builder, you must first make sure and authenticate your Elegant Theme subscription. To do that, go to your WordPress dashboard and navigate to Divi Theme Options. Then click the Updates tab, and then enter your username and API key and save changes. Once done, you are ready to start adding your new pages with their corresponding new layouts. To do that, navigate to Pages, Add New. Give your page a title, and then deploy the Visual Builder. Then select the option Choose a Pre-made Layout. From the Load from Library pop-up, go ahead and scroll down and find the Hosting Company Layout Pack and select it. There you'll see a preview of all of the page layouts included. Once you find the one you want, select it, and then click Use This Layout. Once the layout has been loaded into your page, don't forget to publish it. Now all you need to do is continue the same process to create all of your pages with their corresponding layouts. Once done, you're ready to create your new menu for your website. To do that, navigate to your WordPress dashboard, and then go to Appearance, Menus. Give your new menu a name and then select the Create Menu button. On the left, you'll see an option to select all of the pages that you just created. Go ahead and select all of those and click the Add to Menu button. This will load all of your pages to your menu structure area and then you can organize your menu items however you like. After that, make sure to select your display location as the primary menu and save your menu. And for one last step, you're gonna to want to add a static homepage to your website. To do that, navigate to Settings, Reading. Under your homepage displays, go ahead and select a static page. And then for your homepage option, select the homepage with your new homepage layout. Then click Save Changes. Now your new website is up and running. Well, that's it for this video. Thanks for tuning in, everyone. We sure do hope that you enjoy the new layout pack. And don't forget to subscribe to our blog newsletter, YouTube channel, and like us on Facebook. That way you don't miss out on any future freebies or layout packs we're going to be throwing your way. And don't forget to check out our next layout pack, which should be released on Friday. Thanks again for watching. We look forward to seeing you in our next video.